Um, the Affordable Health Care Act um, is, has been changed administratively along the way. What are the fixes that you see the Affordable Health Care Act needing during the next term of Congress? Well, the most important fixes are fixes that are going to make it easier for people to get access in Iowa to affordable quality health insurance coverage. And we've taken specific steps to try to do that by allowing people to keep their policies in the individual market, by making paperwork burdens on small businesses that were a concern, by removing that problem, and also by making sure that people um, find out whether they're eligible or not for some of the expanded coverage that the Iowa legislature and Governor Branstad made possible and that I worked with them on to make sure that they were allowed to get that type of coverage. 80,000 Iowans have taken advantage of that. We also need to make sure that people who are having problems understanding how the Affordable Care Act is impacting their availability of coverage, get answers to that. But we can't go back to where we were before, and that's where people could get kicked off of their policies because of pre-existing conditions, where women could be charged more for insurance than men, and where seniors were paying more for their prescription drug benefits because of this uh, donut hole that we're closing. Very good. Thank you. Thank you.